Hello friends, on behalf of Cerebellum Academy, it gives me immense pleasure to welcome Dr. Karen Jetson, who has scored a wonderful rank of 174 in INICT in November 2024. So Dr. Karen Jetson, first of all, congratulations to you and your family. How are you Thank feeling you, right sir. now? I am feeling overwhelmed, sir. I can't believe it. It's still sinking in. Wow, wonderful, wonderful. So what was your first reaction on seeing the rank? And which branch flashed in your mind? Uh, I wasn't able to believe that I got 174. Because uh, I just went and casually get uh, wrote the exam. I was mainly aiming for NEET PG. Hmm. So I was waiting for counseling. And meanwhile, the exam happened. So I happened to just go and write. And uh, wanted to take OG, sir. Okay, <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. That's very nice. Uh, Dr. Karan, a lot of students are going to watch this interview because they are preparing for the next INICT and NEET PG exam also. So if someone is preparing for May INICT, what advice you can give him regarding course completion and revisions? Do they matter? Revisions, do they matter? Yes, sir. Revisions matter a lot. Uh, only because of revision, I was able to go through my long-term memory and uh, do well in the exam. Okay. Uh, it really helped. Revisions uh, is the key, sir. Revisions and the pra and practicing MCQs daily. Okay. So how did Dr. Karen actually prepare for INICT oblique NEET PG? How did you actually prepare using cerebellum? Uh, sir, I, I dropped a year, sir. I am uh, belong to 2017 batch. Come from a private medical college. Uh, I When I first gave my NEET, my zero attempt, I didn't uh, do that well. I got 23,000 rank, but it wasn't sufficient to get into a government college. I wanted to uh, go into a government college. So I planned to take a drop. Then, uh, so I decided to drop and then give the next year's NEET exam. Uh, meanwhile, I came across uh, Zainab Ma'am's DTR course from Cerebellum app. So I subscribed to that. Uh, I think May in it, last year's May in it, I uh, subscribed to the app. And uh, I went through the BTR uh, previous uh, a week before the exam. And I was able to get 3,000. Uh, so that motivated me. Uh, I felt if one month of preparation could get me 3,000. So I thought maybe if I work harder, I can get a better rank. Wonderful. Friends, Dr. Karen is telling you systematic structured preparation is the way forward. So like cerebellum, like BTR, if you can have a structured preparation, from 23,000 to 3,000 to 174. That is really a commendable hats off to you. Thank now, you. Dr. Karen, you also utilized examination and discussions from the Cerebellum app. Yes, so how yes. did they help to you? Uh, so they helped me in testing my knowledge, sir. And when I viewed the uh, discussion video, I was able to like uh, understand how to solve an MCQ. Uh, solving, uh, the, the finding the way uh, to solve an MCQ is the main part. I think that is what gets you the rank. Everyone reads from the same resource, but ultimately we have to know how to solve a particular MCQ. That's what I think the fetches the rank. Okay, wonderful. Now, when you gave the exam, students come back, watch recall sessions, discuss with friends. So at that time, were you getting a feeling, okay, this may be your best attempt till now, you can actually crack a good rank. So honestly speaking, I didn't uh, you at any recalls or anything. I was okay. just feeling uh, after need. I just wanted to get into a state, good state medical college. And then uh, I was going out, uh, having hanging out my, uh, with my family and friends. Uh, I just happened to give this exam. Uh, but when I gave it, I was confident. I had a seat in my hand. I just went and uh, gave my best. I had a good feeling when I came out of the examination hall. I gave a good exam. That's what I thought, no matter what the result was. Wonderful. Dr. Karen, I've been meeting students since last 20 years across the country and abroad, both from government and private medical colleges. Many a times, students from private medical colleges share with me openly, frankly, sir, that we, since we belong or to a private college, we don't feel fully confident that we can crack an exam like INICT. So what is your message? for such students who are sitting in a private college and preparing for the upcoming examinations? So it's not like that. Uh, that's what I understood from giving the exam. Anyone can do it. Uh, an FMG, a, a person from a private medical college, anyone, not necessarily a topper from AMS or anyone. Anyone can give it. If I can do it, any can, anyone can do it. That's what wow. I felt. 
Wow, wonderful. And before we wrap up the interview, can we have a good rapid fire round? I will ask you a very basic thing. Whatever okay, the first yeah. word or sentence comes to your mind, you can say. Sure. Feeling right now. Uh, confused, happy. Okay. <laughs> Satisfaction levels. Uh, maximum, sir. Maximum. Cerebellum. Uh, Dynam Boraman. Yes. And if you get, if you get OBS and Gaini in the college of your choice, then? Then I'm going to party hard. I don't know, sir. I'm really, yeah, and, really overwhelmed. Okay. And party will have, will get an invite from you. Cerebellum will get an invite. <laughs> My party is really boring, sir. <laughs> okay. Uh, Favorite subjects? OBS Gaini. OBS Gaini. Okay. And PSM, I usually thought, uh, initially thought in my third year that PSM used to be a boring subject. And uh, when I started reading it for me, I, I started liking it. I okay. even got a gold medal in my college for PSM. Okay. So it's a very high yielding subject. Thank you. Thank you. And on your right side, behind you, there is a photograph. Yes. So yes, who sir. is the photograph? Uh, my mother, sir. She's a logician. My mom she and dad are doctors, sir. My ma mother is an obstetrician. My dad okay. is a surgeon. Okay, wonderful, wonderful. So I think that is a legacy that you are going to carry forward for your parents. And which city you are actually based in right now? I am from Tamil Nadu, Chennai. Okay, Chennai, Tamil Nadu. So can I expect a party on Marina Beach next time? <laughs> sure, sir. If you connect with me, I'll definitely give you a party. Okay, and last question from the rapid fire round. Love. Love, <laughs> family and friends. Absolutely. This should be the way forward. Family, friends, after that, our profession comes. Yes. Well, it was really wonderful, Dr. Karen Jessen, talking to you again Thank from you, the whole Cerebellum family. Heartiest congratulations. Thank Go you. out, party hard, join, and then don't forget Cerebellum. Sure, throughout sir. Your I will never forget. Throughout your PGship also, we are going to stay with you and later also stay connected. All yes, the best. Sir, sir. Thank you, sir. It was a really honor speaking to you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Take Thank care. You, Bye -bye. Thank you, sir.